Hey YouTube, in this problem we're going to find the derivative of this function. So it looks like we have a product, so we're going to use the product rule. However, before we find the derivative, it could be beneficial to write this as follows. So the t over 6, we can write that as 1 6 t. It just makes it easier to think about. That way when we take the derivative here, we'll just get 1 6. So times, then we have the hyperbolic sign of negative 3 t. Okay, let's go ahead and take the derivative using the product rule. So h prime of t, so the product rule says you take the derivative of the first piece, which in this case is 1 sixth, because the derivative of t is 1, times the second piece, so cinch of negative 3t, plus the first piece, so 1 sixth t, times the derivative of the second piece. So the derivative of cinch is cosinch, so we have cosinch of negative 3t, but we have to use the chain rule. So now we have to multiply by the derivative of the inside function. In this case, the inside function is negative 3t, so its derivative is negative 3. Let's check that carefully. So the derivative of the first is 1 sixth, check, times the second, plus the first, so 1 sixth t, times the derivative of cinch of negative 3t. The derivative of cinch is cosinch. We left the inside untouched. Then we multiply by the derivative of the inside, which is negative 3. So the final answer is h prime of t, 1 sixth cinch of negative 3t. And I guess we can cancel here, right? The 3 and the 6 cancel. So you're going to get like a negative 1 half t hyperbolic cosine of negative 3t. And that would be the final answer in this case. I hope this video has been helpful.